Mr. Sulu, you have the con. Once we're en route, I want you to transmit a targeted comm burst to Harrison's location. You tell me you have a bunch of real big torpedoes pointed at his head, and if he doesn't play nice, you're not afraid to use them. Is that a problem? No, sir. I've just never sat in the chair before. You're gonna do great. Jim, wait. You just sat that man down at a high-stakes poker game with no cards and told him to bluff. Now, Sulu's a good man when he is no captain. Yeah, for the next two hours, he is. And enough of the metaphors, all right? That's an order. Mr. Sulu, make sure that Kenormian ship is ready to fly. Acting Captain Sulu to Shuttle Bay 2. Please have the trade ship we confiscated during the mud incident last month fueled and flight ready. Captain Kirk is en route to you now. Ready to deploy, Captain. Lieutenants lose the red shirts. You are Knormian arms dealers. Put those on. Sir? Look, if this thing goes south, there can be nothing tying us to Starfleet. Unless, of course, you want to start a war, Mr. Hendor. No, sir. No, sir. Good. Me neither. Detecting a single life sign in the Katha province. Given the information provided by Mr. Scott, this is most likely John Harrison. Mr. Sulo, I think we found our man. You let him know you mean business. Hi, Captain. Attention, John Harrison. This is Captain Hikaru Sulu of the USS Enterprise. A shuttle of highly trained officers is on its way to your location. If you do not surrender to them immediately, I will unleash the entire payload of advanced long-range torpedoes currently locked onto your location. You have two minutes to confirm your compliance. Refusal to do so will result in your obliteration. If you test me, you will fail. Mr. Sulu, remind me never to piss you off. Arrive at Harrison's location in three minutes, Captain. It is unlikely that he will come willingly. I calculate the odds of him attempting to kill us at 91.6%. Fantastic. 